Today I'm gonna take another look. I'm gonna take a look at another duck rabbit beer. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is the only beer by them that I have not had. This is their their uh, their most recent seasonal, their Baltic Porter, um, and I've heard that it's amazing. Nine percent alcohol uh, should be great, and I'm going to enjoy it in my duck rabbit seasonal snifter. There's the little symbol for the Baltic Porter. It's got their little labels for each of their seasonals, which I think is pretty cool. Um, there's my bottle cap opener. There it is. Okay, so we'll get into that. Um, like I've told you before, Duck Rabbit is probably my favorite uh, North Carolina brewery. One of my favorite breweries of all time. And I'm really excited to try it because I've heard nothing but good things. And I just really love Duck Rabbit, so let's see how it does. Okay, in duck rabbit fashion, there's not much of a head. Uh, dissipating really quickly, kind of like a dark brown or light, I don't know, light brown tannish head. Um, uh, completely black. Can't see anything through a body. No light even at the bottom or on the edges, nothing at all. Um, mm, that smells awesome. There's like um, big um, espresso really dark dark chocolate uh, just really nice earthy notes that's what one thing i love about porters is when they have those really dirty earthy kind of smells and flavors um it smells just very earthy um there's a, a bit of a spicy hot presence um some really nice sweet characters in there maybe a little bit of like a man there's a candy smell in there what is it like a really dark candy uh anyways um Maybe some dark fruits, but there's really mostly like a, br a burnt brown sugar, molasses, maybe like a maybe a, like a licorice kind of smell too and coming through. Not much though, maybe just faintly. But there's some really nice smoky flavor smells in there as well. Let's see how it tastes. Holy cow, that's huge. That is really huge. Man, that's really good. Okay, so first taste you get, smoky, really smoky, roasty, uh, campfire kind of flavors. Not like a not like a like a smoke beer, but but just like like something just got burnt in your mouth. It, um, like burnt coffee, burnt sugar, uh, smokiness. Um, really, really good. Uh, there's some really nice roasty dark malts in there. Some some uh, like uh, some really bitter dark chocolate. Uh, bitter burnt coffee, um, some woody flavors, maybe some like tobacco and leather kind of flavors. Um, there's not too much hoppiness in there. Maybe just a slight amount, but not too much. If there is, it's kind of just a kind of just a, a, a bitter, spicy hop. Not not too much of anything else besides that. Um, but man, that is really really good. Just that is just really awesome. But just full, thick, tons of flavor from beginning to end. Um, leaves a nice mouth feel, a nice, uh, a nice aftertaste in your mouth. It's just all around really, really good. Uh, and I and I just you know I'm not surprised. Duck Rabbit really just nails nails pretty much every beer they try, and this is really, really delicious. There's a, there's a lot of really nice coffee flavors in there for sure. Like, yeah, that's really good. But, um, but yeah, so that's their Baltic Porter, which I guess is pretty much just like an Imperial Porter. 9% alcohol. Anyways, thanks for coming back for another review. Come back for more. Duck Rabbit Baltic Porter. It's been a great beer.